Taliban on City's flight. Yo! What up, people, and welcome back to my next Acast. Hope you guys are having a good day. Today, we're reacting to five ways to stop Man City 2023 the treble. The Brody won the Premier League, the Champions League is on the way, the FA Cup is happening this Saturday. I'm going to be doing a watch along, so make sure to be there. And I also stream every Friday at 6 pm, so make sure to be there as well. A lot of people being up in the arms. We need to find a way to stop Man City to win the treble. I mean, that's going to be a great achievement for them. I wasn't there when we won the treble when the 98-99 season. Man United fans and Pundit combined, they've been up in the arms saying, we need to stop Man City to win the treble. That's not going to happen. I mean, I've watched Man United. I'm not even convinced that we can beat a stronger team. When we won the Carver Cup, Brighton were a weaker team. And we expect us to beat the best team in the Premier League? You out of your mind. Like, think about this, yeah? Man City are the best team in the Premier League, i.e. They've lost five, they've drawn five. They have five players a team of the season. Harden has scored 36 goals, and he hasn't even played a lot of games. Pep Guardiola has won five Premier League titles on a trot. Well, since he joined the 2016 and 2017 campaign. And you expect us to stop them? Records are there to be broken. And one more thing people are not understanding and even fathom is the record that is going to be cemented in the history books. Is the five trophies that City could have. That's the Community Shield, the Carabao Cup, the AFA Cup, the Premier League and the Holy Grail Champions League. And... Comment down below what you think about this take. And don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe. We're trying to reach 2,000 subscribers. And don't forget to follow both of my social media, Twitter and Instagram, Icas and Icas RM. And join the membership as well to support the channel as well. That would be much appreciated. Five ways to stop Man City winning the trail. Number one, you lose. The final whistle goes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and City win 3-0. <laughs> I'm looking at wannabe. <laughs> Special announcement. Special announcement? Ladies and gentlemen, it's me, Mark Got I mean, Debbie Hewitt. Who is that? Comment down below. I don't know. I'm last born and bred and chairwoman of the FA. This year, we have introduced a new rule. New rule? Who does she think she is? Do a leaper? <laughs> <laughs> Law 18. For every empty seat in a cup final, the offending team shall be deducted one goal. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> so it's nil-nil and extra time. So the final score is Man City, minus 6,459, Man United, nil. Man United win the FA Cup. <laughs> what? Yes! yes! <laughs> oh, shit. Number two, Harry Maguire. Mm. It's uncanny. So, so, so you want me to give the ball away? Yes. Hey, so, wait, this is all funny. <laughs> <Nah>. <laughs> she looks like Tarzan. Give away some penalties. Yes. S -s Score some own goals. Yes. And kick my own players in the head. Yes. Basically, just play like you normally do, but for Man City. N -n no problem, boss. <laughs> N never fear, Harry M N Nathan Ake is here. Rashford's wait, what just said Nathan Ake? Through on goal, what a tackle by That's Ake! Tackle. What? Well done, Nathan. Ake has it. What skill by the Dutchman? Harlan's in. Go! What an assist by Ake! What? Well done, Nathan. De Bruyne with the corner. Ake scores. <laughs> That's his hat trick. What? Well done, Nathan. Wait a minute. You know that's not Nathan Ake. Of course I do. But one team talk for me, and I've turned Maguire into the best defender in world football. Pep is the only person that could do this. Nobody can. I mean, I'm happy he's leaving, but we have to pay him 10 million. We could just loan him. <laughs> Done. Yeah, 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 yes. <laughs> Number three. Go retro to stop City winning the Champions League. By getting the Taliban on City's flight to... No way! Istanbul. What? No. No? No. Oh. By giving Inter's ex United. No! I can't believe. Hey, they're too quick. Mega the Stallion was here. Did you guys see in uh, Twitter what happened? It was in um, someone's wedding. That's where he was spotted. 
Tits sub some advice on the best ever to do it. Sharing them in Solskja. Minutes remain and into trail one nil. Goal! Mkhitaryan scores! Seconds remain and we're heading to extra time. Oh no, we're not! Into win the Champions League! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Number four, the Dead City Band. FFP? No, we need something that will actually stick. Cheese. Come back! What? A travel is ours. It's a man. Don't stand it. Hey, let me talk! Hey, Jack, it's Erling Hurdy Gurdy. Can I borrow your phone, please? Yeah, of course. Oh my god, them two saying they're the best friend. That's actually clack. Sterling. Wait a minute. Everyone be well. Several players have had their phones stolen in the last few days. What? Where did it go? Okay, so now you have the phones for Pep and the whole Man City squad. Do your worst. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm a Tony. That's so funny. <laughs> That's amazing. Man, that betting. Just Mr. Tony. So you want me to place 232 bets, yeah? Her phone? Yes. On it. Breaking news. The whole Man City squad have been banned <laughs> until January 2020. The whole Man City squad balanced from all football. Well, later. For, for a string of betting events. Activities and tears. As a result, Inter Milan have been crowned winners of the Champions League. Revenge! Yes! <laughs> Number five, time to call in a favor from an old friend. Simone Inzaghi, aka Thomas Tuchel. Oh, yeah! And my star center back, <laughs> Alessandro Bastoni, aka Antonio Rudiger. Rudiger! Rudiga, Rudiga, Rudiga. The Bruyne Black Eye incoming. Yay! An Inter Milan 1 0 defensive masterclass incoming. Yay! Thank you guys for watching. That was absolutely freaking funny. I absolutely enjoyed it. And so let's further ado. Goodbye.